choose image for task category and for selection, I'm going to select single label image classification. Consider this, you want to label images so you can create a data set for training your machine learning models. Can you do this by setting up a labeling job in SageMaker Ground Truth? Let's find out. Let's start by navigating to the S3 service. Then let's go inside our test bucket. Here, I'm going to upload six images of cats and dogs, which we'll set up a labeling job for very soon. Next, let's head to the Amazon SageMaker service. Then scroll down in the left menu and expand Ground Truth. Click on labeling jobs, hit create, then give your job a name. Select automated data setup, then pick the S3 test bucket that we just uploaded the files to. Choose image for data type, then create a new IAM role with access to our test bucket. Click on complete data setup and confirm that you see a manifest file in your test bucket. If you download this manifest file, and open it in a text editor, you should see a source reference to all the image files that we uploaded earlier. Next, choose image for task category. And for selection, I'm going to select single label image classification. Hit next, then choose private for worker types. Note you have the option of selecting on-demand workers and third-party vendors as well. Give your private team a name, then enter the email addresses of your workers. In this example, I'm just going to use my email address. Let's leave the timeout and expiration time to their default values, then enter an organization and a support email. Under image classification, let's enter a brief description of our task then enter two labels, one for cat and the other one for dog. Click on preview to confirm that everything looks as expected, then hit the create button. Verify that your labeling job status now says in progress. Next, let's head to my inbox, then click on the link to log into our labeling project. Enter the username and the temporary password then choose a new password to log in. Give it a few minutes, then hit refresh to confirm that you see a new labeling job. Let's click on start working and begin labeling our images. For some reason, only four images were pushed to my queue. Let's give it a few more minutes, then hit refresh again to label the remaining two images. Click on start working to finish labeling the last two remaining images, then let's head back to the Amazon SageMaker tab. Give it a few minutes, then hit refresh, and the status of your labeling job should now say complete. Go inside your job and scroll down to the output section. Here, you should see all your images labeled now. There you have it. And if you want to learn how to make machine learning predictions, Without writing any code, check out this video right here.